A new record turnover was set at the Tatsil's July sale, surpassing the previous record set in 2006. It was Fanciful Angel, a late entry to the sale from Marco Botti's prestige place, who top proceedings were making 135,000 guineas. Selling to Global Equine Group, the 107 rated gelding by Dark Angel was signed for by Adam Driver and the listed winner will be staying in training with Botti under Touch Gold Racing's ownership. Shazim Zizali continued where he left off when going to 120,000 guineas for generalship, a new approach colt from John Gosden's Clare Haven stables. Out of the Dubai destination mare Al Awazel, the three-year-old was offered, having won a mile handicap impressively at Sandown earlier in the week. Shazali struck again when buying multiple winner Felix Later from Karl Burke Spigot Lodge Stables for 80,000 guineas. The Monsieur Bon Gelding has earned nearly £80,000 for Burke's yard, having won a valuable handicap at York earlier in the season. Lot 846 Stars and Angels was another of Dark Angel's offspring to be well sought after and another to go the way of Jazim Jazali, this time for 68,000 guineas. The filly is a one-time winner from Mick Appleby's yard and is a granddaughter of Group 3 winner Cathy College. Tadsell's marketing director Jimmy George reflects on a successful week at Park Paddocks. I think it's been a very successful July sale, uh, record turnover exceeding 12 million guineas which is a good sum for this sort of sale uh, surpassing the previous record which was set back in 2006 so yeah we'd have to be very pleased with the way everything's gone. I think there's been a great depth to the trade throughout the week. Got off to a very good start largely comprising breeding stock, well-bred fillies, well-bred mares, particularly well received was the Godolphin consignment which was real quality and that brought buyers here from literally all over the world. Our regular major consigners, the owner breeders, Shadwell, Judmont, Cheveley Park Stud, as well as Godolphin, you know, they sent some really high class stock to the sale and I think they've been very well rewarded for that support. Clearance rate nudging 90% again sh just shows you bring quality stock to the market and you will be well rewarded. Another key feature to the week's trade has been the weakness of sterling uh, in the last few weeks that has definitely provided overseas buyers with unprecedented value in terms of recent years sterling remains weak for the remainder of the year i think that will be a recurring feature one other thing that that we were particularly pleased about this week was uh, the impact of uh, uh, mr zhang yusheng's yulong investments mainland chinese buyer having a significant impact on the sale. It was his first visit to, to a sale in, in Britain, first visit to a sale at Tattersall's, and uh, I think he, he enjoyed himself and has gone home with some, some nice stock. It's a special year for Tattersall's, it's our 250th year. It's fitting that the July sale 2016 has, has been a record sale.